Hey guys, welcome back to John's Watch. Today I'm taking a look at a game called Avenging Angel. Now this was released on Steam on June 1st, 2015. It's developed and published by Dark Amber Softworks, which is a uh, small independent development team from Finland. And its regular price is $16.99 Canadian, probably $15 US. And apparently it's a, it's a, a story-driven adventure FPS game uh, set in a steampunk kind of environment. And you definitely get that vibe from uh, these two characters. If you can hover over, you can see this is Vincent Recreven, or Amity Seagrun, I think. Yeah. Uh, the, the graphics look beautiful in the screenshots. Uh, I've got this turned up to high graphics right now. I might be able to crank it up to ultra. Uh, I'm not sure. Let's just hop right into it. We'll do a new game. All right, here we are. So we start with a wrench, very Bioshock-esque. Oh god. Mind coming down to the flight deck? We just received word from high command. Looks like you got yourself a mission. Okay. I can't bash things yet. Oh, I can with right click. Can I break boxes? Oh. No. <laughs> but I can't hit things. Okay, down to the flight deck. Ooh, push. Should I push this? Like... Oh, I have to push it this way, I guess. Hold. Ah, and because it was in my way, obviously. So I can just hop onto here. Do I have to like activate activate something? Or do I not even need it? <laughs> May I just go see the, the captain? <laughs> I'm sure he'll probably tell me what's up. Can I run? I can. Is this it? Oh. Uh okay. You wanna see me, Skipper? Change of plans, associate. I am now dropping you off at Thunderhead Point. What's Thunderhead Point? I've never even heard of it. Well, not many have heard about it, but this is what I know. Thunderhead Point is an island in the middle of this restricted military airspace we are now flying in. I think it used to be a research facility or some such, but no one really talks about it. It's one of those places around here that supposedly don't exist. Yeah, one of those places. Uh, okay, what are my uh, mission parameters then? Hey, I'm just driving the bus here. The I am not authorized <laughs> to see any of that stuff. Now, go fetch the briefing codex from the terminal back there. Ooh, the codex. Okay. Uh, where's the codex? Oh, is this it? Download mission parameters. Battery power 214 years. Wow. Ethernet online. Local files encrypted. Ghost drive. Soul cannot be saved. Oh my god. Let's download these parameters. Access elevator at uh, Nexus Tower. Where's that, Captain Jack? Um, never mind. Can I? I can't back out of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um. Oh, here we go. It's down here now. I'm stepping in it. Ah, begin mission. Yes, please. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. Is that Stand you, Jack? Stand by for final approach to Thunderhead Point. Smoke all you like, and since there are no seat belts, <laughs> don't mind them. Thank you for flying NCS Navy, and try not to screw this one up. What do you mean this one? Uh... Here we are, Thunderhead Point. He's just he's just chilling there now. I've got lots of birds up there. Are they birds? They, they look a bit like birds. Huh. Oh. Is he gonna fly away? Oh, he is! Bye! It's a bit of a strange horizon line out there. Looks a bit odd. That's okay. Oh, I should mention this game is in early access right now, by the way. Should mention that at the beginning. Uh, open. Oh. Lots of garbage on the floor. Ooh, an espresso. Like a health potion? Can I pick up all these things? No. I was hoping I could just grab all these potions. Ooh, a journal. Pick it up. Metaphysical monthly. Fantastic. Can I climb one here? Yes, I can. Can I pick this up? Oh, can I pick this up? Nope. Ooh. Oh, it looks very nice in here, doesn't it? It's a little, like... Microscope or something? Some nice bunk beds. 
There's good amounts of lens flare in this. I like it. <laughs> Alright, let's go up these stairs. Let's quit mucking about. Oh, it's a bit hard to navigate these stairs. It's kind of nice how vague it is. You do get a bit of a, bio, uh, a Bioshock, a Bioshock feel. I can't use these telescopes. There's not much to see out there. Um, yeah, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing up here right now. Can I activate this thing? Aha! Uh. Sweet, I turned it all on. What did that even do? Started this fan going. Okay, maybe we should go downstairs now. Can I take fall damage? No, I'm okay. Can't open this cupboard though. So now this wheel's turning. Don't know why it needs to be turning though. Oh, bathroom, fantastic. Oh, you can't use the bathroom. You're gonna, gonna lose marks for that one, developers. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I think we probably have to go through this door. Oh yeah. don't really know where we're going, though. Let's do some sprinting. Should we go over to this thing, I guess? Does it say anything about my mission if I, like, press escape? Oh, I'm Vincent. Vincent Trekovan. Oh, gain access to the Nexus elevator at the tower. Anyone see any towers? <laughs> do you think that's it? Oh, here we go. Tower! Perfect. I could do lots of exploring, and I'm sure it would be if I was just playing this uh, in my spare time. But I do like to try and show off as much as I can in uh, the, the first like 20 minutes of the game. It's usually how long these videos are. I think everything's cell shaded. Well, I don't know if everything's cell shaded, but a lot of things are. You can see up there, uh, the rocks are cell shaded and the windmills there are. I wonder if you can change that. Graphics. Doesn't look like it, video. No. It's not a problem, I was just wondering if you can. I don't think most games would let you uh, disable cell shading, though. It's usually a graphical choice that they choose. Okay, this must be the tower, perhaps? Knock, knock. Motherfuckers. Oh, here we go. Slot. Oh, I need something, obviously. I need a key from somewhere. Where would I find a key, though? Got a bit of a mystery and exploration right now. Yeah, it's definitely cell shaded. You can see that quite easily against the sky. Is my stamina going down? I think it is. You can see in the bottom left, my uh, the green bar above the running guy is going down. Oh god, I can feel a sneeze coming on. <laughs> It's not, it's not coming. It's trying to, though. Do I still have my wrench? I, No. Ooh. Ingredients. We've got espresso. Good. We've got our outpost map. Parts. Nothing else, really. Have I got a sword? I've got a field tool. Oh, that must just be my... Huh. How do I, how do I... Goggle glass. Goodness. Looks like quite a, a depthy game. <laughs> Okay, what's in here? It's locked! Open up! Damn it. <laughs> Anyone got like a... like a... oh. Um... I don't know why this ground is so low res right here. But that's quite high res, and we're not allowed out, apparently. There's an invisible wall there. Oh god. That's a robot man, hello? Uh. Finally, you and I have much work to do. Much work. Uh, care to explain? Yes, work. You must. You bring me things. Needful things. I will let you pass. Uh, <laughs> what things? I'm not your fucking servant. What tough one are you? You are not getting anywhere unless you give me what I want. <laughs> I like this one. Uh, what is it that you need? These were things that made me in the town near the hangar. You might want to pick up that 
Google Glass upgrade on the table. It is connected to the bird drones flying around here. They will show you the way if you get lost. Uh, anything else I should be aware of? There is an old pistol Ooh. and some ammo. The gun range outside. Give it a go if you are out of shape. Rest assured, you are going to be needing them. You should also check out the workroom downstairs. There might be some useful stuff. Great. Thanks, fella. Uh, who's this she that you mentioned? Your mother. Now get going. Wow. Rude. Okay, thanks, fella. Is this goggle glass upgrade somewhere? Ah! This upgrade links your goggle glass to surveillance... Uh, to... something. Surveillance bird drones. So how do I... Ah! So I can add it, so you get like three upgrades. So how do I do it? The drones will circle above areas of interest. Okay, how do I use it then? And there's also some shit downstairs. In the Z workshop. Oh, we've got a load to go into the workshop. Better be good shit in there. Aha! Ah, here we go, the outpost wall, outpost wall valve. Look at this thing. <laughs> uh, here we go, a workbench. Oh god, look at all this stuff you can do. Uh, modify. I don't have any modifications available. Can I craft things? No, I don't have any blueprints. Uh, obviously when I do, this will be a good place to come back to. And there's nothing to do here, I don't think. Holy crap, I've got feet. Fantastic. Time to go back upstairs. I'm surprised they left this key just hanging around in someone's basement. <laughs> there we go. Use crank. You have to hold it this time. Got that squeaking. Is this going to open now? Hello? Oh, there we go. Fantastic. What's this? Travel to forest? Huh? What? Um, I don't think we want to travel yet, do we? But this is not opening. So maybe we do want to travel to forest. That's weird, why does it keep bumping me up there? <laughs> There's a couple of bugs with this game so far. Okay, let's travel to forest. Whee! I'm sure this is probably what we're supposed to be doing. Okay, here we are. Hangar tower, okay. Whoa, my frames need to recover a bit. There we go. It's me. Sorry. I hacked into your Google Glass system and uploaded the last known locations of the things I require. Equip your glasses and follow the bird drones. Be on the lookout of my machine brethren over there. Some of them are less friendly while the others have lost more than one of their control centers. I am also reading some unusual activity near the mines in the south. You are not alone. Godspeed. Okay, so how do I equip my goggle glass? Don't know. And how do I get my weapons? Uh, the frame rate does take quite a hit right here, by the way. If I'm looking back here, I can get I get 50 to 60. If I'm looking over here, I just get 30. <laughs> you, you shouldn't see a difference in the video. It's just uh, just interesting. What's this? It's nothing. Oh god. Uh, hello, robots. How's it going? Oh god, I have to do combat at not 60 FPS. How do I fight? Um, why is it not letting me fight? Uh, where's my... Okay, how do I get, how do I get my... How do I, how do I get my, uh, my weapons out? Uh, key layout. 
Um, oh, goggle glasses G. Okay. Holster weapons, maybe R. Oh, maybe the numbers. Okay, there we go. This is probably my gun. Okay. Oh, my my UI is gone now. My HUD's gone. Oh right, that doesn't attack. It's so weird that right click is attack. Oh god, I've got cracks across my face now. Yeah, why on earth is right click attack? Ah. Whew. That was horrifying. Okay. Oh, I just turned it off. Okay, here's my goggle glass, and here's without. Interesting. So I had it on already. Holy crap, look at my health. I was almost dead there. Okay, let's just let's just run past here. I don't know if any more are gonna pop out. Actually I need to rebind this. Uh controls. Oh I see it's attack with left weapon and attack with right weapon. I suppose that makes sense. I'll allow it. This time. Memorial, tower and hangar. Okay, well I want to go to the tower and hangar, right? Look at those swirly things over there. Very swirly. The poppin' is uh, very obvious in this game. You can see all the trees just like changing color and more trees popping in in the back. Very obvious. Oh god, are those spider things ahead of me that I have to fight? Yep. I don't know if I can take any more hits. I don't know if I'm even hitting it. Oh, I killed it. I can't loot these guys, unfortunately. Do I have anything that'll heal me? Let me drink it. Nope. My health is at three. I think if I press Q, I can dual wield. Nope. The mine's over that way. I'm dead. I am very dead. <laughs> I mean, I couldn't have taken any more hits, really. Is that it? Is that like a game over screen now? <laughs> God, it's not permadeath, is it? Uh, continue? I'm level zero, apparently. Didn't even know there was a leveling system. <laughs> so that's a bit weird that it puts you back to uh, the main me. menu when you die. I hacked it uh, instead of... <laughs> and uploaded instead of just uh, bring you back. Oh, I do have ammo. Okay. And follow the bird crones. Be on the lookout of my machine breath. Oh, I think the bird look the, the bird drinks with the orange things over there, okay. I will say combat does need to be improved quite a bit with what? Uh combat does need to be improved a lot in this game right now. It feels quite unresponsive. Uh it's fairly unsatisfying. Uh, it's, it just feels very clunky. And supposedly combat, you know, it's going to be quite an important part of this. Oh, a forest map. Don't mind if I do. Uh, yeah, so it, it does need does need a bit of improvement, the combat. But I'm doing better this time already. We've got to go take out those spiders again now. I don't know why I like flew up into the air that time. <laughs> Or last time, that was nuts. Okay, spiders are still up here. Hoop, hoop. I wonder if it's like Skyrim, where you, you just like jump everywhere, because it's faster. <laughs> I don't really know if it is. All right, spider, meet your maker, bitch. It's also very hard to tell if you've actually hit anyone. And I'm just riding this guy now and he's dead. I'm almost dead again. Okay, we better just shoot this guy. Uh. Oh, he's dead. Jeez. Okay, let's get the old wrench back out. Can't wait till I can get a better weapon than this wrench. <laughs> okay, so you can see the, the orange swirlies over there. That's where we have to go, uh, according to this guy. We just have to follow the, the bird drones. God, something's going to attack me somewhere. Oh god, they're back there. Let's just Dark Souls this and run past them. How fast do they run? Probably not very fast. 
running. Yeah, I can totally just like walk away from these guys. Just speed run this shit. Try and get to the next area. I've lost where my bird drones are now though. Bird drones, oh here they are. Oh, what the fuck am I going this way? Oh, music just changed. Oh, the combat music just went away, I guess. Do, 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 do. So right here, right? Like this barrel? <laughs> Not this barrel. Okay, the birds are right here. Is there supposed to be something here, birds? Maybe just down here? Um. Oh, do I have to go inside? Haha! -ha. Enter the bunker. Okay, well, I think I'll take a break now. Not just because we've entered a creepy area, uh, but because uh, my time's up. <laughs> um, it, it's it looks like quite a promising game. Like I said, it is in early access right now, and it does have quite a few issues. I think combat does need quite a bit of improvement. Um. It needs a little bit of optimizing, I think. I know some frame drops somewhere, uh, like some places, and other times I'd be running, like, I'm running 70 FPS right now. But I think it's definitely a game to keep an eye on. So it is called Avenging Angel. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Oh my god! What's wrong? Uh, I may have aggroed the dragon slide. Uh, how much health does he have? Oh, 27,500! Holy shit. <laughs>